Hi everyone, so we are back and today is actually Christmas Day on my uh, set of the time zone. So initially I wanted to do this uh, right away at a stroke of 12, but you know, I, I was too tired, I got knocked out. So, you know, the today is Christmas morning, so we will be opening the Greater Gifting Crystal that I have saved up. I think I got about 20 of them and... Technically, my, you know, baby account still owes me one greater gifting crystal. So, I believe by the end of the event, I could hopefully have another five more. Because I think I'm still slightly short for the last two milestones. So, I'm very close to the second last milestone, which actually gave another greater gifting crystal. But, uh, as you can see, I'm short of units. So I'm currently doing the beginner and the normal mode of the monthly uh, event to get the 150 units. So without further ado, we will be opening the 20 gifting crystal followed by I think 2 featured 5 stars. And I have for the first time completed, yeah not, not explored, completed variant 4. So we do have some rank up gem that we could open. Okay, technically I guess we should open the rank up gem first before we move on to you know the other crystal. So what other crystals are there? So I think that's about that. Uh so yeah, we will start off with the three rank two to three ranked up crystal. So we're just gonna pop them open. So we got tech, we got cosmic, and we got skill. Two to three, rank two to three, which um, it technically just saves you five uh, T two alpha. So over here we have one of the rank 3 to 4 ranked up crystal. So this crystal is uh, the much uh, sort, of sort after one as it actually saves you 4 T2 alpha. So that's actually a really rare resource and it would you know substantially help you in accumulating them for rank 5 or rank 2 your 6 stars. So yeah, over here we stopped on a mutant. So this is not limited to the year as per variant 1. Or oh, I'm not sure if they have changed the rewards yet. But since we have this rank 3 to 4 ranked up gem that... Oh, okay. I can't check it. I think I'm still in the middle of some battle. I'm trying to explore uncollected. Okay, fine. Then we shall proceed with our crystal opening. Uh, but for that ranked up gem that we have picked up, I do have a few candidates. We are looking at Awakened Sunspot, Awakened Colossus, Awakened Iceman, who I have been withholding their rank 4 because you know there are there always seems to be better options but Colossus is a very high candidate right so moving on we will be opening the 20 greater gifting crystal so I'm not sure if you guys have like seen it on social media some there are a lot of people who have uh, opened like <clears throat> okay we let's not talk about uh the six star heroes or six star kang or like five star tunnels but there are people who has opened 15k six star shards 15k five star shards and i think that is the kind of rewards that we are we want to get as well as the five star awakening gem crystal which is Standing here at about 2%. Yeah, so for 6 star hero crystal shards, actually 10%, but the amount varies. 
So yeah, we're just gonna be popping open the first 10. Okay, so we got 1k 6 star shard, we got 3k 5 star shard, we got, uh, this is decent, we got uh, 110 of a T5 basic catalyst and there's no awakening gem there. <coughs> I feel like that is an average. Is that is the average? Is that an average pool? I have no idea. So on my you know alliance uh, side, uh, I got someone that pulled a five star tunnels. We got people that uh, pull ten k six star shots. Okay, signature stone. Uh, the worst rewards that we could. And gotten and also there are a lot of them who have put five star awakening gem which is really useful and you know i do hope to be able to you know get a skill awakening gem so that we can awaken Akion. Wow. What, what, what the fuck was that okay so that seems to be Another thousand six star shots. Right, so you know this they are not really showing the reward, so we can't tell what we are getting until it pops up taking a lot of time, so we will not be spinning them anymore. So I think this reward is Oh okay, so wow we got another Oh, that was double the amount of T2 Alpha shards that we have gotten just now. So anyway, we're just going to be popping over the remaining 7. So okay, we have formed uh, some catalysts. Is this an Awakening Gem? I don't think that's an Awakening Gem. So, right, so it's a T4 class catalyst, which is... Uh, quite useless to us as I have like 15 to 13 of them stocked up and we are still not able to you know open a 6 star champion from that right so I would actually say that it's quite a disappointing pool. There was no surprises. Okay, that's fine. Um, hopefully, you know, with the remaining crystal that we would have, we would get by the end of the event, uh, there would be something better over there. So... Now we will be opening the five star basic crystal, and if we awaken, no, I no, we would still not have sufficient for a six star hero. So anyway, I would prefer if we got you know some newer god tier champions compared to awakening them to get the six star shot so without further ado we're just gonna click stop on this crystal and let's see who we get Hawkbuster will have been, been he's getting the buff and we have already awakened ghost. Uh still beast is not a pool that he would like. It has been quite bad so far with this crystal opening. So anyway, the drop rate for this crystal so uh, uh, the six new characters are actually Arceus, 
Mr. Fantastic, Doctor Doom, and you know Manting, Gulatine Two Zero Nine Nine, as well as L Star Bloodstone. So other good champions that I would like would be Dark Hawk, who have I have been trying to get. Mm, oh, Black Widow is nice. Uh, there's Beast here somehow. Let's uh not get him. Mm, I'm looking for a good Mystic champion. So really would you know if we could pull Doctor Doom that would be fantastic. Uh yeah that's about it for champions that I would want. Oh, that's Arc Angel as well. So that's definitely a plus. <sighs> okay, so I'm really quite nervous. It has not been a good so far so we are hoping to salvage thing with these two final crystal so that we just got quick stop over here on the first featured five star crystal <sighs> so we have already awakened hawk uh we would awaken you know spider gwen if there was a rollover or and if there was a rollover we would have awakened our Gula time to zero nine nine. Right, so I think with that dude we would have enough for a six star kill crystal, so we will be opening that as well. So down to the final featured five star uh, top two that I would like would really be Dark Hawk and Doctor Doom. So we're just gonna click stop over here and Wow That was just bullshit man So in between two you know got tier we got uh Dark Hall and Ark Angel and you know we landed on Psylocke Man, right, you know, Christmas opening, guys. Real swell. So we will not be opening a featured six star. That was a fast fiasco as well previously. So I think with most of the new champions added in, the pool is large. There are decent batch of champions. And you know, I just hope to get one of them. Some hopefully someone that doesn't need to be awakened. So with that, we just gonna click stop on our next six star hero crystal. Fuck! What the fuck? <sighs> right, you know, six star moon knight. So he is irritating in the variant quest. Especially the one where you have to use the 3-star champion because uh, that's what makes Master Node and makes his evade uh, kind of ridiculous. Right, so we have opened all our crystal for this. Uh, oh, what the fuck? Ah. Right, so it it has been a bullshit pull. And with that, you know, I hope you have a better Christmas opening or Christmas... Uh, no, I hope you have a better crystal open opening than me on this Christmas day. And, you know, I wish all of you a Merry Christmas and hope you enjoy the long holiday as well as a Happy New Year. So with that, we shall end this video over here. <sighs> Yeah, and I will see you on the Greater Gifting Christmas.